Congratulations, Majma San. We've earned 2,000 fans from the Club Moon area. We're one step closer to the boss of the five stars then, Sukiyama. He's the only member of the five stars remaining. We've got to keep our guard up. For sure. Maybe we should take a trip down to Club Moon when we have the time. I agree. Just give us the word. Excellent. We're coming too. Yuki-chan, I-chan. This is the final cabaret for club for us, Majma-san. I can't let sit by and let you handle everything by yourself. I've always wanted to see what Club Moon is like. Please let me go with you. Fine. If it gets even a little dicey, I'm pulling you both out of it there. Okay. Okay, it's got a pretty cool uh, logo thing, sign on the front. Don't know what you'd call it. So this is Tsukiyama's Club Moon. It's got all the bells and whistles and a great location to boot. No wonder it's the five stars best club. Wow, it has such a regal feel. I'm practically blinded by how sparkly and bright it is. You should see how it sparkles on the inside. Yeah? You don't say? Wait, who the hell are you? Um... Wow, you're quite a cutie. Can we help you? Yuki-chan, don't you know who she is? Ai-chan, you know her? Of course. People say she's Sotenbori's best hostess. She's Club Moon's Mana-chan. Oh, Ai-chan, formerly of Club Mars. Thank you for that splendid introduction. Club Moon? Ai-chan, it's so good to see you. I've heard you're over at Club Sunshine now. Are you having fun over there? Yeah, it's a riot. Oh, good. I'm glad to hear that. So, Mana-chan, right? What's your angle sniffing around us like this? Oh, but aren't you the one sniffing around? I mean, you did come to spy on us today, didn't you? Eh, how'd you know that? Well, if you're here to spy on us, wouldn't you like a peek inside? I can give you the grand tour. What? You're just going to show us your club? Wouldn't Tsuki... Yama, rain fire on you if you did that? Oh, don't be silly. He won't get mad. To be honest, he asked me to do it. Say what? He told me you guys would come today around this time, so I should show you around. That's more or less what he said. How does he know all this? Tsukiyama-san's pretty amazing, you know. I've heard he's got lots of ways to gather intelligence. So he saw us coming from a mile away, huh? Come on, isn't it cold out here? Let's all go inside the club. That okay with you? Yuki-chan, Ai-chan, we're going back. Huh? Really? You're leaving already? Why? Tsukiyama's already got us beat on the espionage jangle. We're nowhere ready to beat Club Moon in the shape we're in. No way. So let's head back for now. We gotta get Club Sunshine in top shape. Quick-like. Sounds good to me. Yeah. I see, I see. Sounds like a wise decision. Fair warning, it won't be easy to beat Tsukiyama-san. <laughs> easy is for chumps. Our club's gonna be so amazing, even your jaw's gonna hit the floor, Mana-san. You wait and see. Ahaha, <laughs> good luck. Club Sunshine, huh? Mana-san. Oh, Katomi-chan, how's Tsukiyama's favorite assistant doing? I'm well. And how are they? They seem like they're having a lot of fun. Like there's something exciting going on, you know? I see. You know, maybe you should try having more fun with this, like they do. I don't see the point. This is a business. Now, is that how you really feel? Club Sunshine. Goro Majima. Let's see how far you get. Okay. It's a lot of female voices in a row. I need to work out like one more. I think I'll be set. <laughs> Congratulations, Majima San. We've reached 5,000 fans from the Club Moon area. We've sure come a long way. But to compete at the same level as Tsukiyama Han, we're gonna need to be even better. 
Much, Masan. I want to learn how to have a never-ending drive to be better like you. It's been a while, Club Sunshine. Hmm? You look familiar. My name is Kotomi. I'm Tsukiyama's assistant at Club Moon. That's right. You were here when the five stars showed up. How can I be of service, Kotomi-chan? Tsukiyama directed me to pick you up, Majimasama. Pick me up? Where are you taking me? If you would just follow me, I think you'll see. Yeah. Majimasan, don't go. This has to be a trap. He's right. That pretty assistant lady can't tell you what to do. Yeah. Nah, I'm going. Don't do it. If you go, there's no telling what might happen to you. That's exactly why I gotta do it. Can't leave this to anyone else. Yoda-chan, Yuki-chan, you guys take care of Sunshine till I get back. Mm. Majima-san, leave it to me. I'm sure I'll have quite a story for you when I get back. Shall we then? Right. Oh, it's grand. What? Here? This way. Oh, did he rent out the whole grand like the other dude did? Tsukiyama-sama, I brought Majima-sama. Thank you, Kotomi. Oh, Katomi-chan, Majima-san, great to see ya. <laughs> How have you been, Majima-san? I must say, the seating here is as uncomfortable as ever. Yo, Tsukiyama, what you doing here at the Grand? What a tone to take with the customer. From what I hear, does that not make me your king? Nanyate. You see, I bought out the Grand for tonight. That would make me your customer, does it not? Are you truly surprised? When you get to be a man of my stature, buying out a place like this is hardly uncommon. Alright, so what's the point of all this then? You that desperate to have a drink with me? Ha ha ha! Please, your sense of humor is appalling. Drinking with you would be my idea of a nightmare come true. I simply wanted to pay my respects. What now? Thanks to you, only Club Moon remains out of the five stars. Not in my wildest dreams could I imagine that a little upstart like Club Sunshine could grow so quickly. I wanted to commend you on your achievements. You've certainly worked hard at it. You go through the trouble of buying out my place, then you talk down to me? That's pretty rich. Yes, alas, this is the end of the road for you, it seems. Club Sunshine and even Grand, both will meet their demise at my hands. The Grand, too? The hell are you really after? Very well. I suppose that if you've gotten this far, I can reveal that much to you. My true objective is to take down the Cabaret Grand. Say what? Why on earth would you want to do that? I shall answer that question if, somehow, you defeat me. Regardless, I think I've had my fill of this cheap swill you serve. There's nothing worse for your health, you know. Until next time. Bye-bye. If you continue to oppose Tsukiyama-sama, I strongly advise that you prepare to face the consequences. The streets are dark when the moon is young. Oh man, they've got catchphrases and everything? So that's what happened. Tsukiyama's going after the Grand? And that's why I organized Chokehold and all of the cabaret clubs? Who knows why, but that's the gist of it. But what about that thing his pretty assistant said? Dark streets, a new moon, is very poetic. Man, Yuki-chan, you're about as naive as they come. What do you mean I'm naive? I just don't know what I don't know. Well, I think I get it. When the streets are dark, it's because the moon isn't out. We need to watch our backs. It was a threat, right? I chan Where do you pick this kind of stuff up? Well, we've made it this far. All that's left to do now is take down Tsukiyama. You all ready to help me finish this? Of course. I'll try my best. Let's do this. Me too. I can work every day. Sorry, Saki. You're on ice. You've been maxed out in levels for a while now. No room for improvement. But of course, I'll do whatever you need, Majima-kun. Unless it's go two days in a row. 
I owe you a favor for taking me in, Majima-san. This is my opportunity to repay you. You guys are really something. Wait, was Chica hiding in the fucking save room this entire time? I was wondering why I didn't see her out here. Alright, people. Club Sunshine is about to open for business. So let's go real big today. I'm not a dumb fuck, right? No, she's right here. Why was she in the other room, then? Congratulations, Majma San. You reached 10,000 fans from the Club Moon area. We've come a long, long way. Huh. Yeah, finally. Yep, we're finally going to head to head. You're, you're Mana-chan from Club Moon. Hi, Club Sunshine. How's everyone doing? So I'll bring Sonbori's number one girl here today. Oh, you probably know why I'm here. I have a challenge for you. Tsukiyama-san said he was impressed. He said he didn't expect Club Sunshine to take down the five stars so fast. You're a bit ahead of schedule to go up against Club Moon. So he always knew we'd beat the other clubs, huh? Am I so supposed to be impressed? Oh no, he said he was impressed by you. You're really amazing, really. I can never tell if she's serious or making fun of me. Whatever. Tell Tsukiyama that overconfidence is going to come back and bite him in the ass. <laughs> sure, got it. Although I can't imagine Tsukiyama-san ever losing. See you later. Good luck, Club Sunshine. Wow. I f feel like we just got hit by a hurricane. Maybe that's the confidence that comes from being number one. I think... I think that's just her personality. At any rate, this is the final battle. Let's make sure to sort out everything and whatnot. Yeah, yeah. Alright, first things first. I've got to buy all the fans so that I don't have to grind this shit. Already at 11... 100 because I decided on the last one that I was just gonna... Uh, give expensive gifts every single time. Which I think helped a little bit, but not that much. Don't worry. We'll get to you eventually, Billykin. Where are you taking off? We're still talking here. Oh yeah, we're gonna have so many fucking fans. There's that wonderful smell again. Come to think of it, I didn't actually get anything to eat last time. Now's my chance. No, no. Hey, excuse me. Oh, the Obotarian strikes again. Well, hello again, eye patch fella. You gotta queue up. I'm the end of the line. Huh? Get real. I ain't letting you pull the same stun again. What? You gonna cop another feel? I don't come cheap. Yeah, right. They couldn't pay me enough. I ain't having to repeat myself, but cutting in line is bad form. Get behind me. Oh, hello, Itsuki-chan. How's it going? Oh, Michiko-san. Isn't this place so tasty? Hey, hey! What do you think you're doing? So, reason with them? Look, it's clear as day this time. He cut the line. Now get behind me and wait your turn like a normal person. So unreasonable. I haven't seen my friend here in ages. Maybe I ought to get that stick up your ass checked out, Sonny. Now listen here. Why don't you be quit being so damn selfish? Oh, scary. What seems to be the problem here, ladies? You gotta help us, officer. This scary fellow's being a real terror to us poor, defenseless old ladies. Yeah, we were just chatting each other, and he started shouting obscenities. What? You two windbags cut in line. Now, now, why don't you have some candy and calm down a bit? It's as sweet as it comes. What the hell? You think this makes it all better? What am I, five? Eek! Officer, help! Damn it, fine, screw this. He's just a common thug. How'd I end up getting painted as the bad guy? This Obatarian is one cunning adversary. I'll oh, get the sweet Takayaki or whatever the fuck that is. At some point. Uh, do I have all the... Let's see. There's one more. Meshi Bugyo. Oh, I think that's this. 
Hell yes. What, I didn't get anything for partnering with everyone? Cool. I mean, there's probably like a... A shrine thing for getting all the businesses. Hmm? Help! Pervert! There's a pervert here! You all shitbag! Who you calling a pervert? <laughs> you fell right into the Obitarian's trap. Oh? You dumb hag! Now you're really gonna get it! Whoa, now he's crossed the line! Ah! Nobody gets cute with the Yakuza, bitch! Suck on this! What? Who the fuck are you? The eye patch fellow. Hey, I know this old lady's a real pain in the ass, but that don't give you the right to pull blade on the civilian. Huh? Hey, buddy. I know how you feel. I really do. I got accused of being a perv, too. But it ain't worth it. Trust me. Let sleeping dogs lie. You're no match for the Obitarian. Hell, I ain't either. You're trying to tell me what to do? You mosey up to me and tell me I'm no match for some old hag? You don't know shit, friend. The two of you can share a grave. Actual chump. Should be ashamed. Oh, you ain't bad. Praise is cheap chumming, coming from a chump. Now get lost. Ch no, no. You're the bee's knees, eye patch fella. But I ended up coming to your rescue without even meaning to. I kind of hate myself right now. Well, on closer inspection, you're a fine piece of work. Just like my husband when he's still kind of grabby. My heart's really pounding. Whoa, dial it down. You're creeping me out, lady. No need for any feminine wiles. Oh, but I gotta repay you to set things right. Keep your candy, lady. I don't need the sugar high. Oh, I had something in mind much sweeter than candy. Huh? Come to Granny, you fine, handsome devil. Whoa! She's she's too strong. I can't hold her off. Whoa! Ugh. Pop the cork too early, sweetie. Nothing to be ashamed of. It's been a while for me too. <laughs> Woohoo! Get a room, you two. Oh, please don't tease. The guy at the counter is right. The only thing to be gained from getting involved with the Omotarian is misery. Toughest creature under the sun ain't a pro fighter. It ain't a Yakuza. It's a Sakan Omotarian. Oh man. This is never gonna eat the... I think that's Takiyaki. I mean, there's the little circle things. Aren't Tokiyaki is like a uh, octopus balls? There's gotta be Takiyaki. Hey, you ready? What? You're taking off? You're still talking? Here. Not cool. Oh my god. Oh, you're the fellow with the eye patch. It's been a while. Oh crap, it's Obitarian. What do you mean, oh crap? Is is that what you say when you see when you have a reunion with a beautiful maiden? Try again. Give me a line like, oh, be my still Oh still my I'm such a retard. <laughs> oh, be still my beating heart, it's you. That's better. Now what's this I hear about you rubbing a cabaret club? Is it true? It is, but where'd you hear that? Don't mock the housewife's rumor mill network. If I set my mind to it, I could find out the number of moles you got on your body. Ah, uh, come on, why you gotta be so graphic? Ah, uh, so listen, can I work at your club? Uh, do you even know what a cabaret club is? That's an old lady gonna do at a cabaret club. Come on, do me a solid here. The supermarket I was doing part-time work for went under, and things sure are tight. Besides, I don't 
Don't underestimate the power of an old lady. I'm an expert at making a man feel good about himself. Back in the day, I had any man I wanted under my thumb. I didn't... I really didn't need to know that. Look, I just don't think it's gonna work. Why don't you look for another part-time supermarket gig? No, I'm done with that. I'm gonna give you a real nice kiss again if you don't let me come work for you. Huh? Now wait a minute, let's calm down. No need to resort to threats. Choose. Hire me or kiss me, it's your call. Alright, alright, you're hired. You're so hired. I don't care anymore. See? Isn't life easier when you just get with the program? Thanks, though. I'm really looking forward to this. Oh, she's a gold hostess. Oh, man. It'd have been hilarious if I beat Club Moon with her, but I don't want to fucking grind her for like 30 levels. That would be ass. Let's see, what are her stats like? New girl joined. <laughs> Alright. Let's get everyone out. Except... Fuck. Clicked off the screen. Except for I. It's the Obitarian. 95 talk? Whoa! She's so good! That's unbelievable. And she's got two funny. And triangle sexy. That's good. She's got, she's almost as good at talking as Platinum Hostess Chica, but just at level one. She's better at talking than Yuki. Oh god. Uh, let's see. So we've got pretty much all the stats. You know what? <laughs> you can get in here too, Itsuko. Uh, let's see. Dolly's max level. She's a real good all-rounder. Uh, I guess I'll get Aranda because she's 100 party. So we got talk, party, love. Yeah, we're pretty good. There's no way we can lose with a lineup like this. It's all winners. Shame we can't make over the Avatarian either. There's no fucking way we lose. <laughs> Majima-san, it's been a while. This is the day, Sukiyama. The day we end the five stars. <laughs> tut tut, Majima-san. Your humor is ever in poor taste. To lose against a man like you is unfathomable. I don't care how perfect you think you are, but nobody's a winner or loser till they put it all on the line. You strive to pluck the moon from the night sky, but you all you shall ever grasp is its reflection upon the water. Do try not to drown. <laughs> You're so fancy. Shall we put an end to the charade, then? Are you ready, Majima-san? Of course. Ready, everyone? Hilariously enough, this is basically my lineup. Yes, we'll show them what Club Sunshine is made of. I'll do my best. We'll go all out. Remember to relax and be yourself. I'll show you everything I learned at Club Mercury. For you, Majima-san, I'll do whatever it takes. Mana, are you ready to go? Totally. I'll show you what Sodenbori's number one girl can do. Alright, Club Sunshine. Let's be our brightest today. Final battle. Probably. Man, I hope there's not a fucking Club Earth somewhere. Oh, I forgot to change the club's look for the final battle. Oh, well. Strawberry's good enough. Okay, we only got Small Smile for the love. Mega Rich. Oh, RN Jesus is fucking shining bright upon us. Three Mega Riches in a row? Unbelievable. Is that another Mega Rich? It is. We've got so many fans. 
Get him, Miranda. Hell yes. Dunk the ice. Ice skip ball. Is that another Mega Rich? <laughs> Moon Devil Hand. <laughs> That's hilarious. Oh, I think it sucked the stats from my duders as well. So he went from smile to uh, neutral facial expression. <laughs> Whatever, we're getting only mega riches. We can't lose. Get him, Miranda. All right, loser sign. Let's guess class. I'm gonna have to deal with the fucking flashbang cutscenes over and over, which is super annoying. Damn, no extension? Bastard. Moon Devil Hand. Okay, we've got one fever going. And now I've got three. I think Chica's already with someone else. Gonna have Yuki. Saki's also with someone else. Getting a little fucked by the RNG slightly. Oh! It's the Obatarian's time to shine. <laughs> She's got her own lines too. That's hilarious. Here is Shy Machine. Oh, she's gonna level up so many times. Yeah, we're winning. I've said this like three times. It's just impossible to lose. No. Stop stealing my duders. Yuki's so friggin' tuckered out, too. All the girls are. There's Saki. There's Saki. It's a good thing all the Platinum Hostesses have like 10 bajillion HP at least. It's Tao. It's a lot of HP recovery as well. That's probably another de upside to not nah, just fever spamming. Gives them the opportunity to recover. Though the fever also lets the girls recover, so maybe that's not true. No, he stole my last customer. What the fuck? Oh, thank goodness. Man, that was fucking oppressive. Oh, look at her go. Got 12 levels from one match. We, we won? Yes, we won. We won against Club Moon. We won. Oh, how could this happen? You did it, Majima-san. We only won because we played like a team. Thanks, all of you. Yeah. Congratulations, everyone from Club Sunshine. Really, congrats. I was really going all out, and I still lost. Wow, I can't believe it. Man, we barely scraped by with everyone in our club against you alone, Mana-chan. You're kind of scary. Unacceptable. Simply unacceptable. I cannot lose. This cannot happen. Tsukiyama-san. I can't lose. Not until I crush the Grand. Tsukiyama. Why are you so hung up on the Grand? Fine. As the manager of the Grand, I'll take you on myself. I got no idea what your problem with the Grand is. But go ahead, take it all out on me. You're mine, Majima. Oh, got a whole little intro. Is he gonna at least give me some heat mode? Oh, he's pretty fast. 
He's got early Mr. Shakedown HP. Some good dodges. Can only get a three hit combo before he starts blocking. What a pain in the ass this guy is. Oh, are you serious? Unbelievable. Stop giving me that kick. No! He's actually so fucking tough. But in the most annoying way possible. Okay. This is the way to do it. Get nunchucked. Bastard. Can't believe he's made me do this. Is so powerful. Whoosh. This is actually kind of sad. I feel bad for the guy. Oh, he's still up. Now he's not. I didn't have to drink any stamina ends. Ugh, you ain't bad with your fist, Tsukiyama. I don't need your consolation. I've been defeated. I lost. All right, Tsukiyama, spill it. Why are you obsessed with taking down Sotenbori's cabaret club scene? You got something against the Grand, too. Don't you think it's time to come clean? My true objective was to destroy the Cabaret Grand, the place that killed my mother. It killed your mom? I grew up without a father, you see. My mother worked day after day, earning very little money in bars and clubs. She raised me with that money. It was by no means a life of luxury, but we were happy. But one day my mother was fired. She's accused of stealing from the club. Of course, my mother swore in her life that she was innocent. She may have had money problems, but she was far too ethical to stoop so low as stealing. In the end, the club didn't believe a thing she said. Of course, she was blacklisted. No other club would hire a woman accused of theft. My mother's job search went nowhere. Our meager savings dwindled. At her wit's end, she took out a life insurance policy on herself and committed suicide. That's terrible. Can you actually do that? I feel like that can't be true. I found out later, the real thief was a club employee who was in charge of the books. If only the club's management had investigated even a little deeper that time, or if they'd even considered that my mother might not have been lying, she wouldn't have had to die. You're telling me that club was... Yes, it was the Grand, the very place you manage... Of course, this was all before your time. <laughs> the manager in charge then was a complete and utter fool. Still, my hatred for the Grand will never die as long as I live. That's why I couldn't lose until I destroyed the Grand. That's why I put together the five stars. Man.
mana chain. Tsukiyama-san. Mana, I'd like to offer you a drink. Excuse me. I can imagine how sad you were to lose your mother. And the people who ran the club were awful. They should have had their act together. But if you keep living for hate and revenge, the life your mother gave you will just go to waste. From now on, let's live a little. Let's laugh a little. Your mother would probably cry if she knew you went through life wearing all that pain on your face. Places like cabaret and cabaret clubs exist so people have a place to be happy and to smile. <laughs> I'm pressing X to doubt on that one as well. Mana, but... Look, I get wanting revenge for the past. That's only natural. But there's something you ain't noticed. Thanks to your five stars, lots of people lost their jobs, their money, or whatever. Their lives are screwed now. You're putting all kinds of people through the same exact hell you went through. Sure, I knew that going in, but it was all unnecessary. See? That's precisely why clubs like that exist. They're for times like that. Pain, sadness, regret? Everyone's got them, big or small. They gotta carry that shit around all day. Sometimes it's too heavy to carry around by yourself. Sometimes you want someone to talk to. Sometimes you want to just drink and forget. Ain't it our job to stand by someone like that and help them enjoy a bit of time where they can forget all that? You're carrying too much by yourself. What you need is Club Sunshine's finest to help you forget whatever it is you want to forget. What do you say, everyone? Of course, certainly. You're right, Majima-san. Tsukiyama-san. Let's all have a drink together. Come on. Is he gonna get shot right now? Ha <laughs> ha Predicted. I'm a gigabrain. Hey, Tsukiyama, pull yourself together. Oh, my back. Don't try to speak. Someone call an ambulance. What the hell are you doing? <coughs> Tsukiyama-sama. No, now it's just Tsukiyama. Thank you for everything. Truly. It was only in the end that you became useless. Kotomi! Aren't you on his side? Aren't you his assistant? Yes, I was his assistant, until now. That's all in the past. If he can't earn any more, then I have no further need of him. I was merely using him as a revenue stream. Kotomi-chan. Thinking on it now, the five stars were a joke. Hino, Kazuka, Mizumura, Kanahara. None of them had any business sense at all. Useless trash, all of them. I should have gotten rid of them a lot sooner. Huh? You conniving. Guru Majma. Once I get rid of you, there won't be anyone left standing in our way. I thought it was the guys in the back talking. Listen up, boys. Dispose of Guru Majma and everyone else here. Kill them all. Please, wait. What is it now, Tsukiyama? Begging for your life is so base. It's not my life I'm begging for. The girls here have nothing to do with the five stars atrocities. Ugh. Leave them out of this, at least. Tsukiyama, you've gone soft. I'm begging you. <laughs> Very well. You've been a useful shield for me until now, so I'll honor your final request. But in exchange... Goromajima of Club Sunshine... Come to the Grand. We'll settle things there. I'll be waiting. You need to answer for interfering with my profits. I'll make you pay with your life. Hey, hey. Uh, Majima-san. Uh. Tsukiyama. You all right? Majima-san, I have no right to ask, but would you grant me one last favor? Please help Kotomi. She's, I think she's a really good person underneath all this. Tsukiyama, please pull her back from the brink. Make her see where she's gone astray, just as you did for me. You got it. I'll stop her. I'll give her a lesson she won't forget. Ha! <laughs> Majima-san, that's the spirit. Tsukiyama, hang in there. Tsukiyama! Hmm. I was gonna say, I bet he's in the hospital. I should've, I should've not hit E. Well, at least he's alive. But I can't believe Katomi was the mastermind pulling the strings behind everything. Yes, as long as she's around, so Bori's entertainment district will be under a dark cloud. Ah. Of course I'm going to the Grand. Eh. Ah. Okay. No more yapping. 
Blocks have been removed from the breaker style. Got mana. Just by default. Which is awesome. Is Katomi going to be my last Platinum Hostess? I feel like she might be. Okay, please don't kill me, Candy. <laughs> That's hilarious. Killed so little. Okay, I don't need the Nivo Rich. I just will level up my everything. Is he gonna run after me? No, he's just walking. What a loser. Yeah, of course I'm ready. I want to do a heat move on her and everything. Hey, assistant lady, whatever your name was, where are you? I've been waiting for you. I must admit, this place is beautiful. The interior shines and sparkles. The girls shine and sparkle. This place is so full of bright, shiny dreams. For those who need to forget reality, I'm sure they can find no paradise greater than this. But for some, reality is inescapable. A comfortable house, a full plate of food, and clothes that express one's personality. Only money buys these things. Money is everything. That's why I'm amassing my wealth. The more money you have, the more happiness you can buy. It's true. In this universe, you can also invest it in yourself and make yourself stronger. You see, that's why you have to die. You're standing between me and my happiness. Okay. This money can do anything, have anything, buy anything. My bodyguards are professional fighters and martial artists. Even men like this do whatever I want if I pay them enough. You're kind of a sad little woman. What did you call me? I said, if you think you can buy anything with money, you're truly a sad woman. I know I'm not wrong. With you out of my way, all of Sodenbori's cabarets and cabaret clubs will be mine. It's time for you to make your exit, Guru Majima, soon to be former manager of the cabaret grand. Almost said gland again. <laughs> the hell? Okay. Each one of them is about as fourth as powerful as Sukiyama. Which is quite the deadly combo. Oh, Jesus. Whatever, it's four on one. I can equip weapons. It's not cheating. Okay, wasn't aiming at them. <laughs> what was that? It's a drunken master, I think. Hold up. <laughs> this is just a trident with the swordfish on the end. That's hilarious. Oh, this fucking drunken master asshole. I need to get some distance. That's a pretty good move. Oh. oh, they're so fast. good the good pose he's a good puncher never mind it's a bad puncher oh 
Oh, I can't choke him. Oh, <laughs> Katomi's sitting in the chair. That's hilarious. Majima was about to get shot. The way he like froze there for a sec. How did you do that? Those are my elite bodyguards. Must we gotta pay for ain't worth a damn. Guru Majima, what on earth are you? Now it's your turn. You're gonna get a real earful for all the shit you've pulled. Don't come near me. I made it all the way here. I'm so close. All of the money funneled in Sotenbori's nightlife is going to be mine. Money's all that matters in this world. Ha ha ha. Kotomi, stop it! Nanyate? You okay? Well, I wouldn't say that. I drank a couple stamina of Royales, but my HP isn't full yet. What are you doing here? Did you come to ridicule me? No, Kotomi. I came to help you. Why? I shot you. I used you. <laughs> yes, you did. That really hurt. On both fronts. But you've done so much for me over the years, more than enough to make up for the pain you're causing now. So yes, you may have used me, but that doesn't mean I don't still appreciate you. How? You're not making any sense. Oh, I get it. Money. You're here to help me so you can ask me to share the profit later. How much do you want? That's not it, Kotomi. I don't need money. All I want is you. What? Let's start over, Kotomi. We'll make amends for what we've done, and begin again from scratch, together. We can build a new club. It doesn't have to be big, and this time we'll work for our customers, not for the money. Tsukiyama-sama. What do you say? Let's make this the last of our sins. Please put down the gun. No! Kotomi! I cannot return to your side, Tsukiyama-sama. Even now, I still know that money is all that matters to me. If only I'd had the money, my sister would be alive. Money is everything. That's never gonna change. If you went into business with someone like me, I'd only get in your way. So that's why... Kotomi! Tsukiyama-sama, maybe in my next life, I'll learn to believe in something besides money. If I could do that, would you let me be at your side again? Goodbye. Stop, Kotomi! Huh? I'm still alive. Damn, that was close, lady. Majima's saying why. <laughs> Just looking out for something more valuable than money. Something more valuable than money? Kotomi. You fool. What the hell were you thinking? No matter how much I could accumulate in my lifetime, I could never buy you back. Tsukiyama-sama. Wah! Sob. I get it now. You lost your sister when you were a kid. From that day forward, I lived to make money. I believed it was the only way to achieve security and happiness. But I guess I was wrong about everything. Yeah, more than wrong. Straight up batty. Haha, <laughs> you're right. Katomi, shall we get going? Yes, Tsukiyama-sama. We'll turn ourselves in. We have many crimes to pay for. Right, go set things straight. After you paid your debts to society, I want you two to build the greatest damn club, or y club ever, you hear me? Yes, I'd, I'd like to l build a place like Club Sunshine. The girls, the customers, the staff, everyone's always shining there. Such bright, cheerful smiles. No wonder it's called Sunshine. <clears throat> Kotomi. I can't wait to live an honest life under that same sun, just like you. Do you think I can do it? Yeah, no doubt. Like I tell these girls, a woman's strongest weapon is her smile, not her tears. You're right. <laughs> okay, it's almost go time. Is everyone wary? Ready? Where's Majo-san? 
Ah, uh, I'm so sorry. I overslept. Hey, Yuki-chan, are you okay? Do you want me to do your hair for you? I'd prefer my hair it didn't look like a pompadour with the seagull's nest in it, so no thank you. Wow, I've worked 20 days in a row now. I think I'm starting to get a little tired. Come here, Saki-chan. I'll give you a massage. There you go. That's the spot, right? <laughs> okay. Alright, guess what I made out front? A snowman with Gurokun's face on it. What? It wasn't even snowing today, was it? How on earth did you manage that? Oh, don't tell me you used ice from the ice machine. Wow, good guess, Chikus-chan. Yeah, you know, when I was looking at the ice, I suddenly had the urge to create something. Sorry I'm late. I'm back. Ah, <laughs> uh, Majima-san. Thank goodness, you're just in time. There's a horde of customers waiting by the door. You all ready to do this? Yes, I think so. Let's make today another great one. We'll do our best, Majima-san. We all here, there, then? All right, today we're gonna knock it out of the park with every guest, right? Of course. The usual, then? Yes, all right, here we go. <laughs> oh man, that would be good for a gif. Sunshine! Press right click on the pause menu's top screen to switch the Mad Dog of Shimano style. Why can't I just fucking hit five? What the hell? Awesome. Though. Finally. I'll never play this minigame again. I won't have to. No, I thought Kotomi was going to be unlockable. Okay, so pause. Oh, okay. There we go. <laughs> Legends, thug. Alright, let's see this mad dog shit. Whoa, this tree looks way different than the other trees. Okay. So, heat wave, strength beyond your normal limits. Does that just mean a damage increase? I'm guessing so. Or maybe more heat? Man, I'm gonna need to shake down this shakedown so many times. Get the rest of these abilities. Oh, ultra health boost. Oh, 